अस्तुतर दिशिदेवतात्मा हिमालयो नाम नाधिराज पूर्वापर तोयनिधी वाह्य स्थित पृथिव्या इव मानदंड लुकिंग एट द I think the speech of the devas where they are addressing Brahma, Srishti Karta, and we stopped with this uh, shloka eight. Swakala parimane na vyastha ratrin divasyate yau eva swapna bodhau tau bhuta nam pralayodayo. So the swapna and uh, prabodha that is the sleeping and waking up time of uh, brahma is equal to pralayam and udayam for bhutana for the jeeva rashi swakala parimanena vyastha ratrin divam he uses his time frame to uh, um, separate the night and day of people and also the pralayam and udayam U- udayam here is srishti so he determines the srishti of uh, uh, people okay a minute there was something in uh, malina um, who is that or uh, kale's books so i was just looking at that i wanted to take that out okay we'll move on to the next one and then see if i can pick out that uh, quotation if it's the same thing ah okay no no it's the same thing yadasa devo jagarti tadedam cheshtate jagate yadaswapiti shantatma tada sarvam praliyate whenever so uh, whenever brahma wakes up that is when it is the srishti of uh, uh, the world and whenever he sleeps that is the pralayam of the world next one is jagadyoni hi ayonistvam uh, jagadanta uh, the kala parimanam he had given kale had given the different uh, the time frame for each uh, he calculates it is like 4800 years of gods which amounts to something something and all is there how much of krita yugam is there treta yugam is there he gives some numbers there if you want you can look at it in the notes section for kales okay uh, स जगद्योनि योनिस्व अयोनि जगद अंत निरंतक जगद आदि अनादिस्व जगदीश निरीश्वर सो यु जगद्योनि जगद्योनि यु आर् दि यु आर् द पर्सन हू क्रियेट्स ऑल ऑफ दिस यु आर् द सोर्स फॉर ऑल दिस एंटर वर्ल और ऑल ऑफ द वर्ल्ड this is uh, uh, clearly a vedantic uh, theory of creation so it is ayoni hi tvam at the same time you do not have a source which is there was only one entity brahman and from that brahman you had uh, it got associated with maya and then the world was created in it so ayoni hi tvam parantu jagadyoni hi you are different from the jagat jagat has a source as you whereas you do not have a source at the same time the world has an end jagad antah and that end is you jagad antah tvam eva because the entire world is going to come and merge in you at the same time nirantakah you are not going to go and merge into shunyam like buddhist theory so here it is uh, uh, you are the substratum for everything for the world to come and merge here tvantu uh, nirantakah you do not have an end जगद आदि अनादि तम यु आर् द काज फॉर द बिगिनिंग ऑफ द वर्ल्ड वेर इज यू डू नाट हेव ए बिगिनिंग फ्रॉम दिस डे ऑनवर्ड्स ब्रह्मन स्टार्टेड एक्सिस्टिंग यू के नॉट से सच ए स्टेटमेंट वेर इज फ्रॉम दिस डे ऑनवर्ड्स द वर्ल्ड स्टार्टेड एक्सिस्टिंग दट सॉर्ट ऑफ एन एक्सप्रेशन कैन कम अबउट जगद ईश निरीश्वर यु आर् द कंट्रोलर फॉर द एंटर वर्ल्ड whereas you do not have a controller you are the ultimate controller ishwaraha tvam parantu tava ishwaraha na asti iti nirishwaraha so yasya ishwaraha na vidyate nanu upadanaadi vigna vina katham swapna prabodha matrena jagataha pralaya udbhavaadi upapattihi ata ahu so here uh, जगद उपादान दिना ननु उपादान उपादान कारण उपादान फॉर फॉर अ पार्ट टू बी मेड एनी ऑब्जेक्ट हैज टू बी मेड देन यू हैव समथिंग कॉल्ड एन उपादान कारण विच इज द मेटीरियल कास्ट एंड देन यू हैव द निमित्त कारण विदउट एनी ऑफ दीस हाउ कैन 
Brahma be the be responsible for Swapna and Prabodhamatrena just by nearly sleeping and waking up. How can he cause the pralayam and udayam, srishti of Jagat? What is the connection between the two? See in the earlier shloka, Yasya Swapna Prabodhau, Yau Swapna Prabodhau, Tau Bhutanam Pralaya Udayam, Te Swapna Prabodhau. Your waking up and your sleeping are translated as Jagat Srishti and Jagat Pralayam. Now, how can these two be connected? That is your avatarika here for the next shloka. He says, Nanu Upadana Divina Katham Swapna Prabodhamatrena. Just by mere sleeping and waking up, Jagataha Pralaya Udbhavadi Upapattihi. How can how is it possible that the world can be created by? If I sleep here, in Tamil we have an expression. The moment a crow came and sat on a palm tree, the, the fruit just fell down, it seems. So is there a cause and the you know cause that does the crow become a cause for that? He is the Pura Bakshi is asking a question like that. If he if Brahma sleeps and wakes up, how can Jagat just you know be created and merge? So he says, Tvam Jagat Yonihi, because you are the cause for Jagat. And hence, when you wake up, the Jagat Srishti happens. Jagataha Sthavara Jangamatmakasya Prapanchasya Yonihi Upadana Karanam Asi. So you are the material cause for the uh, Sthavara Jangamatmakam. Sthavaram is uh, uh, sentient, moving, movable, moving and immovable. Uh, things, right? Jangamam is uh, something that is moving. Stavaram is that which is stationary. So this world is made up of both type of Jeevarashi. So Prapanchasya of this world Upadana Karanam, you are the material cause. Anadi Avidya ati, um, Atiraskritasya Swarupasya Agnana Deva Adishtana Bhute Tvai Jayamanasya Prapancha Brahmasya Sarpa Brahmasya Rajuriva uh, tvameva upadana karanam asi. So uh, uh, you are the upadana karanam, the material cause for prapancha brahma, the illusion that is the world. Just like how raju, the this, uh, rope is the cause, it is the material cause for the illusion of serpent in it. For the illusion of serpent to happen on that raju, Anyatra kutrapi tatra karanam na vidyate. You don't have a reason outside of the rope. The rope itself becomes the material cause for the snake. In the same way, for the prapancham, also it is illusory, and for the illusion of prapancha, it needs an adhishtanam, and that adhishtanam can be the only one supreme entity, which is Brahman. So Tvameva Upadana Karanam. Tvayi jayamanasya prapancha bhutasya and this world which is illusion, which is born in you. Right? It is, it is created in you. Katham anadi avidya tiraskritasya. Anadi avidya tiraskritasya rupasya prapancha brahmasya. Agnana eva adhishtana bhute tvayya. Ah, right. So, anadi, anadi avidya atiraskritas, tiraskritasya, that's how we should say, right? Vi avidyaya tiraskrita swarupaha tvam, atma. So, tava swarupasya agnyanat eva. We, since we are ignorant about the swaswarupam of the atma, which is completely tiraskritam covered because of the anadi avidya. Uh, avidya is a, a concept that is accepted by Advaitans, right? So, uh, and it is anadi. There is no starting point for avidya. Ignorance never even in our, uh, uh, you know, experience, small experience we can understand. You cannot, I can say that I started knowing this concept from this day onwards when someone explained it to me. From when didn't you know it? You cannot explain the starting point of ignorance there. So, avidya to anadi era. Anadi avidyaya tiraskrita swarupaha atma tasya atmanaha swarupasya agnyanatu eva because we do not know the real nature of that atma adhishtana bhute tvayi 
in that uh, uh, having that as an adhisthanam this prapancham is born uh, it doesn't fit properly no swarupasya agnyanate eva adhisthana bhute tvai prapancha ah okay yes yad agnyanat vishvam bhavati phanivat rajju shakale that's the shloka he gives there as a uh, connection okay adi avidya avidyaya atiraskrutasya tathapi vaktum shakyate anadi avidyaya yat tiraskrutam na asti tasya swarupam tasya swarupasya agnyanat eva prapancha brahma asti correct even though the swarupam of the atma cannot be covered by avidya it is still swayam prakasha it is just an illusion there right uh, it's confusing if you take it that way <laughs> okay usually tiraskritam means um, covered tiraskritam or or ignored or put aside kila hmm tiraskritam also means uh, antardhanam in the sense it is covered aachaditam anadi avidyaya aachadita swarupasya atmanah agnyanat eva that is the reasoning for rajju brahma or prapancha brahma hmm hmm so that's yasti tade tade tadeva brahma iti ah yes prapancha eva brahma atra so tvame eva upadana karanam asi taduktam the quotation given here is a very different source yeah i was just looking trying to find out what is the source for this shloka it is in a vyakhyanam as a mangala shloka for adena uh, prabodha prabodha chandrodaya shri krishna mishra has written prabodha chandrodaya which is an allegorical play on uh, vedanta just like how sankalpa suryodaya was written by vedanta deshika is an allegorical play for shri vaishnava concepts vaishnava siddha vishishta advaita concepts for advaita concepts you have this play drama which is written by shri krishna mishra it is called prabodha chandrodaya and uh, govinda amrita bhagwan has written a vyakhyana there he is called it nataka bharanam in that the mangala shloka is this shloka yad agnyanat vishvam bhavati ಹಣಿವತ್ ರಜ್ಜು ಶಕಲೆ ನಿಲೀನ ಯಜ್ಞಾನೆ ಭವತಿ ಸ ನಿಧಾನ ತ್ರಿಭುವನ ಯದ್ ಉಚ್ಚೈ ಆಮ್ನಾಯೈ ಸತತ ಅವಗಮ್ಯ ಮುನಿಜನೈ ತದೇತ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಅಹಂ ಸಹಜ ಪರಮಾನಂದ ಸುಭಗ ಅಯನ್ ದಟ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ ದಟ್ಸ್ ಆಲ್ ತತ್ ಎತತ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಅಹಂ ಹಾಂ ಕೆನ್ ಯು ರಿಪೀಟ್ ದಿ ನೇಮ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ವ್ಯಾಖ್ಯ ವ್ಯಾಖ್ಯ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟಕಾಭರಣ ವ್ಯಾಖ್ಯ ರಿಟನ್ ಬೈ ಗೋವಿಂದಾಮೃತ ಭಗವಾನ್ one second nataka bharana okay nataka bharana vyakhya has been written by govinda amrita bhagavan is this a recent work i mean this the commentator here is probably 18th century or 17th century right this commentator... definitely this commentator is should be 18th century something like that 19th, 17th century yeah he should okay. be earlier actually okay so so mm-hmm. narayana mish narayana pandita narayana is quoting from the vyakhyana kol nat nataka bharana by govinda mishra which must have been a similar probably a recent work or he may be time. a recent work or at least it must have been known by him no or his uh, sahapathi who knows you know if it was a colleague it would have been uh, even easier for him to get hold of it because uh, uh, arunagiri natha does arunagiri does not quote does that not quote so this mm-hmm. might this might be a more of a south indian or a kerala work possible hmm. possible so yat yat gnanat vishvam bhavati yad agnyanat vishvam bhavati so agnyanat eva because we do not understand due to the ignorance of that atman yad agnyanat vishvam bhavati the the world appears so vishvam bhavati vishvam does not the world does is not created here it just appears here yad agnyanat because of the ignorance of atman the world appears just as how rajju shakale in a piece of rope phanivat like a, a, a serpent which appears because we do not have the knowledge of rajju rajju shakalasya agnyanat tatra phanihi bhavati nilinam yad gnane bhavati sanidanam tribhuvanam yad gnane bhavati sati 
when the knowledge of which appears in our mind which is when the knowledge of the atman uh, appears happens bhavati sati tada tribhuvanam sanidanam nilinam bhavati at that point of time the three worlds sanidanam along with its karanam nidanam is karanam nilinam bhavati it just completely merges or it just disappears the world with its cause disappears yad uchchaihi amnayaihi satatam munijanaihi avagamyam it is to be understood yat that which is to be understood avagamyam satatam avagamyam that which has to be always understood by munijanaihi by both sages and uh, uh, uchchaihi amnayaihi by uh the um uchchehi can mean um uttama amnayehi that the greatest of uh, uh, texts which is vedas amnaya okay so yad uchchehi amnayehi satatam avagamyam munijanaihi tad etat brahma aham so that which is because of whose uh, ignorance this world appears and because when the knowledge of which as soon as the knowledge of which happens the world and its reason completely disappears and that which is to be understood only by the shastras so shastra yonitvat right so only that which has to be understood by the shastras that is called brahma and that brahma is nothing other than brahma that brahma is nothing other than aham okay brahma jeevan and what is the swarupa of that brahma atma which is sahaja paramananda subhagam sahaja that which is act, uh, born with one's own birth sahajayate iti sahajam so it is natural paramananda it is the greatest form of bliss and subhagam or there is another reading madhuram in the text actually Uh, in the uh, prabodha chandrodayam there are two places where there is a difference here subhagam it says madhuram and here instead of bhavati it says jhatiti so when that gnanam happens immediately jhatiti tribhuvanam leenam bhavati the end, uh, the world disappears immediately and here you say madhuram it is sweet the the gnanam is sweet and it is also the greatest form of bliss and it is sahaja it is always present with you it's not that it went away and then came back as soon as uh, gnanam comes right so it is ever present within you you don't realize it that's why we say it is realization and not liberation so if it is if it is subhagam what is the meaning of subhagam subhagam also means uh, um, good fortune or aishwaryam mm. uh, you can also say aishwaryam there Right? that which is uh, um, shakti which has all the capabilities right tadrasha atma swarupam aham iti okay so he takes this as a uh, quotation and substantiates its his statement here that jagat dyoni in the sense of jagat being the brahma which appears on the adishtana bhuta brahma Whereas Brahma does not have another substratum there. Tvam punaha karanam tera rahita ha. Whereas you do not have another karanam for yourself. Yoni hi upadana adi karanam asya na asti iti ayoni hi. One who does not have any other upadana karanam etc. Itham devasya jagad upadana tvam uktva kartritvam asya ahu. उपादान कारण उत तदनम कर्ता अलसो द डूअर ऑफ एव्रीथिंग हि मेन्टेन सेट सो सृष्टि एंड देन स्थिति सो जगत ईशा जगदीश जगता स्वामी यु आर द लॉर्ड ऑफ दिस एंटर वर्ल्ड उत्पादक रक्षिता चाइट सो सृष्टि एंड स्थिति कारण यू डू नॉट हैव एन अदर ईश्वरा फॉर यू सो निरीश्वरा ईश्वर रहिता उत्पादक रक्षिता च तव न अस्ती यू डू नॉट हैव एन अदर उत्पादक दट इज अ सोर्स नॉर डू यू हैव समवन हू हैज टू प्रोटेक्ट यू जगदोनिवात जगद उत्पत्ते पूर्व विद्यम एवं जगद आदि 
the existence of brahman is not decided based on the existence of jagat because you don't you don't conclude by looking at the that is only for people who do not believe in that existence of brahman before then you will have to show this world and say okay there must have been a sarvashaktiman creator who has created this world and go from this way to that way otherwise the best thing is jagat jagatam adihi eshaha eva yatah jagatah kartrutvat okay so jagatam adihi ata eva anadihi we can say from when this jagat was created but we cannot say from when the atma swarupa was created atman was created so adihi asya na asti iti anadihi purva koti rahitah ityartha one who does not have a uh, beginning point koti is like a point bindu so purva koti rahitah samhartritvam api ahuhu jagad antah so, uh, srishti sthiti and then layam all three are being said at the same time there is also a, a, a swarupa which existed beyond the jagat srishti sthiti and layam that's why jagat anadihi jagad adihi okay samhartritvam api ahuhu tvam jagat antaha you are the cause for the uh, end of this world wherein the world comes and merges into you jagatam antaha iti ka avadhikarah asi not adhikarah asi so that va is missing so he is included it in the uh, vyakhyana here uh, edition you know these are all when they uh, edit the manuscripts when they get the manuscripts they will find that the va is missing sometimes it needs certain emendations like this you need to correct so tvam punaha samhartr rahitah you do not have a person who is going to destroy you or you don't go and merge with something else so antakah asya na asti iti nirantakah aparakoti rahitah one who does not have the end point for him so the purva koti is the beginning point and aparakoti is the end point nice nice words there <laughs> okay So, jagadhyoni rayonistvam jagadantaha nirantakaha so srishti and pralayam the next one is jagadadi ranadistvam jagadisho nirishwaraha jagadishaha nirishwaraha is sthiti karta here beyond these three and beyond the jagat he has a value he has a standing which is jagadadihi anadischa okay what is the next one <clears throat> Next one is full Gita Shloka. Atmanam Atmana Vetsi Srijasi Atmanam Atmana Atmana Kritina Chattvam Atmani Eva Praliyase so, Atman, Atmanam Atmana Vetsi You understand the Atma with the Atma. It's better to go with the Vyakhyanam here. Otherwise, we'll only keep repeating the word Atma. So, Atmanam Srijasi Atmana You are creating Atmanam yourself which is that is the jagat ishvara abhinnatvam tatra vartate iti karanat sarvatra atmaswarupa siva vidyamanatva evam he uses the atma everywhere so atmana kritina chatvam atmani eva praliyase you are the cause for the leena and everything goes and uh, uh, merges within you nanu upadak upadaka sorry utpadaka an उत्पादकाहित्ये दृश्यम से चतुर्मुख से कथम उत्पत्ति यूज दि अवतारिका हियर इज इफ यू से देर इज नो अदर क्रियेटर उत्पादकाहित्ये बट द क्रियेटर दट वी सी इन फ्रंट ऑफ एस ईज ऑफ अ डिफरेंट फॉर्म हियर चतुर्मुख ब्रह्म करेक्ट सो कथम चतुर्मुख ब्रह्मण उत्पत्ति अत्र हाउ डिड दिस् फॉर्म ऑफ the creator brahma akar eh? in bhagavatam in the, i think in the fifth chapter or sixth chapter somewhere narada asks you know he tells brahma he says see in in my eyes in my perspective i see you as the creator but whereas you are sitting down and uh, thinking about some other uh, person and you are doing dhyanam tapas who are you thinking about so there must be an adhisthana for you also so the one the explanation there is he is the ishwara swarupam 
with along with the maya and without the maya there is the brahma swarupa which is uh, uh, maya rahita nirmala swarupa okay and he contemplates and meditates upon that bhagavan to give him that srishti knowledge so nanu utpadakantara rahitye when there is no other creator drishyamanasya chaturmukhasya the chaturmukha the form that we see in front of us kadam utpatti how is there a creation of this person here tvam atmana atmanam vetsi atmana swayameva atmanam srijyam swadeham vetsi janasi you create your own body ishvara is also created by himself he wants to satpo tapyata bahusyam prajayeti he thinks and he decides to uh, uh, create different forms of himself right so samaya abhi puru purupa iyate because of maya he is spoken of as someone with the pururupa with a lot of different uh, forms so atmana eva by yourself atmanam that which is srijyam that which has to be created that which is fit to be created you create right srijasi or vetsi janasi srishtehe सृज्य स्वरूप अवगम अधीन आद सृज्य स्वदेह तत्सृष्टि उपाय स्वयं जानासी यू डोंट नीड अनदर पर्सन टू गिव यू दट नॉलेज यू योर सेल्फ नो इट बिकॉज ही देवर्स अंडरस्टैंड चतुर्मुख ब्रह्म एज द ब्रह्म स्वरूप हिमसेल्फ हि द ब्रह्मन डिजाइड्स टू क्रिएट ए फॉर्म फॉर हिमसेल्फ एज ए क्रिएटर ही वॉन्ट्स टू टेक ऑन ए डिफरेंट फॉर्म just like how we put on different disguises we don't need to uh, you know always be in a certain form of the, uh, you know and present ourselves to people the same way brahman also decides he wants to take the form of chaturmukha brahma in order to create the world so you know atmana atmanam vetsi so atmanam srijya swarupam yat vidyate the the form that has to be created as for a person who has the four faces tadrisham adau swadeham tat srishti upayancha swayameva janasi so you know what form you want to create and what is needed to do that creation okay and how do you know about it so atmana eva swayam eva janasi tadanantaram tu srijasi ityahu atmana atmanam srijasi so first you have to understand so when you have to create something you have to understand what it is and then only create so you understand what you are and what you want to create first and then you create the world so srijasi atmana eva atmanam atmana swayam eva आत्मानं स्वदेहं देहं ईश्वर देहं और विराट स्वरूपं विश्वरूपं सृजसि सृष्टं करोषि यू मेक इट हैपन स्वयमेव स्वदेह सृष्टि ही अपि सो स्वदेहस्यापि स्वयमेव संहर्ता इट गोस एंड एंटर्स इनटू यू एंड देयर इज नो अदर फॉर अस इफ वी लुक एट द जगत देयर इज समवन हु डस है ना हु हैज टू Uh, 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 you know bring in the uh, pralayam for this entire world whereas for you you do it yourself atmanam eva leenam karoshi so the when he says swadehasya api swayam eva samharta okay that it's clear the previous sentence was swayam eva swadeva srishtihi swadeha srishtihi no hmm. that but still that when you say when you say swadeha srishtihi it it could have been swadeha srashta that would have been clearer right no 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 so srishtihi ittute swayameva srishtihi api jayate iti na avagatam uh, so the the creation happens by itself oh oh Oh, as a connection to the earlier line atmana swayameva atmanam swadeham srijasi srishtam karoshi which hmm. means swadehasya srishtihi bhavati swayameva oh ho tavadeva that's all the, the uh, creation happens by itself ha 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 okay because the what is being created is non non different from 
the creator himself the creator. ah okay and because That's the creator, okay because the creator does not have another creator it just happens by itself it is ha okay okay so the now that the creation has happened swayameva samharta swadehasya he has taken another form now is the the deha srishti hi tu abhuta atra and then you will have to take in that form and merge it with whatever existing whatever is existing okay ha so kritina atmana atmani eva kritina kriti is kritakritya one who has performed what has to be performed yat kartavyam tat sarvam tena kritam iti karanat kritakritya kriti idi tasya vipatti so kriti is a person who has achieved everything that has to be achieved he has taken a form and the form is to do a certain particular set of uh, work that has been assigned to him after he has finished all those works he is going to stop this and uh, he will bring in his body to himself so it is uh, kriti hi iti kartruvachaka padam ha huh, kriti anama prathama ek vachane kriti hi eva bhavati kala na na kriti kriti hi illa kriti kritina atmana iti hari o oh, o oh, o oh. anama nakaranta padam va kriti edilla ee eeni prathema edo onnu irukla adla o kriti i think there is you know kriti na like yogi you know yogi na guni guni na guni na so kriti iti ek prathama ek vachane because if you say kriti hi that becomes karma vachaka and that is a karma or the action itself itself But here, yeah. when he says "kriti na," he means uh, "kriti kriti na kriti na," and it means the karta. Kritam prashastam asya iti. So kritam oh. or kritam shilam asya iti. Mm. One who uh, efficiently finishes what has to be done. Mm-hmm. So after his avatara is over, avatara job is over. So kriti na atma na uh, atmani eva praliya se kriti na krita kritye na. स्व अवतार कार्याण विधान निर्वृत्न आफ्टर फिनिशिंग ऑल ऑफ हिस् अवतार कार्य कार्याण विधान आफ्टर बिकॉज हि हस् फिनिश्ड पर्फॉमिंग ऑल ऑफ हिस् अवतार कार्य निर्वृत्न इज रिटयर्ड नौ हिस् टेकन वेकेशन हियर सो आत्म स्वेहन कर्णभूतेन आत्म देहम तो कर्ण स्वेहमे कर्ण आत्मा ती इज द कर्ता हियर हि हिमसेफ इज द कर्ता हिस् देहम बिकम्स द कर्ण टू पर्फॉम ऑल दि अवतार कार्य आत्म स्वस्म प्रलीय से प्रकर्षेण लीन भवसी यू टेक इन दट देह एंड मर्जिट म आद आत्मदेहस्वूप तत्सर्ग उपाय स्वयमे जानासी you know the sarga upayam srishti upayam you know the uh, uh, method to create your own body with, with you use that as the instrument to perform certain actions then tatav param tam srijasi you then create that body sarganantaram punaha parardha dvaya vatsara paryantam until the such and such a time parardha dvayam that is your uh, time limit for brahma tat paryantam rakshite swadehe you protect your body and keep creating things sv avatara karyeshu nirvrutteshu after all of your avatara karya is done finished nirvrutam kritakritya hasan having accomplished everything being successful swadeham sv atmani eva leenam karoshi you merge it within you atra manuhu evam sa sarvam अचिंत्यपराक्रम आत्मनि अंतर्दधे भूय कालम कालेन पीड़यन् सो एवं सर्व सृष्ट्वा इदम सृष्ट्वा इदम सर्व इज जगत मं चृष्ट्वा इवन आफ्टर क्रिएटिंग मनु विच मीन द जीव हि क्रिएट्स द जगत एंड द जीव अचिंत्यपराक्रम बिकॉज हिस् पराक्रम दिस् प्रॉविस इज कम इन इट कैनाट बी थॉट अबउट एट आल यू कैनाट थिंक ऑफ द पवर्फुने आल पवर्फुल नेचर ऑफ हिम सो आत्मनि भूय अगेन कालम कालेन पीड़यन आत्मनि अंतर्दे हि पीड़यन मीन मर्जिंग और कनेक्टिंग संयोजयन Uh, uh, each one time to, there is no concept of time after that that's what it means 
so he just merges the time with uh, uh, the existing time the constant time constant and then he uh, completely disappears antar dadhe iti atra swadhina atma sarga sthiti pralayasya asya brahmanah paradhin sargadehe prapanchat vyatireka utti he is different from any normal creator because any normal creator needs certain things from outside to uh, create something whether it is uh, you know creating a pot or uh, something he needs certain outside uh, uh, um, influences so whereas here brahmana uh, sargasya srishtehe swa adhina atma sarga sthiti pralayasya even his own creation he depends on only himself he does not have to depend on another person so paradhina sarga dehe any other srishti for us even our body has to be created by somebody else here so what he says so prapanchat vyatirekah atra so the jagat has to be created by somebody else so this brahman is different from this prapancham which has a creator which is dependent on somebody else for a creation whereas brahman is does not depend on anybody else for creation it depends only on itself like a spider bluta tantu so so here um, <clears throat> so swadhinat swadhinatma sarga sthiti pralayasya asya is describing brahma brahma then uh, that uh, paradina sarga dehe is describing prapanchat pancham no that, mm. that brahman is now uh, prapanchat so brahman is in panchami there right then no no so brahmanah vyatireka ukti hi prapanchat vyatireka ukti hi oh brahmanah oh ramasya lakshmanat vyatireka ukti hi ramasya oh, okay. vyatireka ukti hi something like uh, yeah Every, so, sometimes it can be confusing with fifth and sixth case uh-huh. in this cases yeah so 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 vyatireka ukti vyatireka ukti hi nama atra alankara vishayana parantu kevalam just a difference ah uh, bedah okay yeah hmm. just a difference that's all you can say alankara but there is no great uh, uh, you know chamatkaram as oh, such in yeah. such thing so is it more a of a stating of fact okay Mm. because in the in the verse actually uh, uh-huh. where does this vyatireka happen because he is saying uh, uh, it doesn't it is not there so it is just a vyangyam that's all uh, okay. it's just showing that he is different from other creations that's all uh, other than the prapancha okay if you if you have to connect it you have to connect it from the earlier shloka saying jagadyoni hi and jagadantaha jagadishaha uh, and even his own creation is different from the creation of jagat how does he create how is he created then ayonihi iti chet tasya utpatti hi katam syat aam aam so atmana eva atmanam srujasi iti so that's the connection there hmm? yeah so the vyakti reka is between ayonihi which refers to brahma and jagat yonihi which implies that jagat has got a yoni yes so that's the vyatireka yeah atmanam atmana vetsi srijasi atmanam atmana atmana kritina chatvam atmani eva praliyase okay uh, the next one is uh, actually fairly easy one we'll quickly go through this this is just uh, udghatah pranavo yasam ूर्वुक्तं so tasam giram prabhavah tvam yasam pranavah udghatah yasam udghatah the beginning of which is pranava okay the you are the source of vedas which is introduced by pranava upo we say upadghatah right upadghatah is introduction so udghatah is again is the introduction here 
So Pranavaha Eva Udghataha, for the introduction of which Vedas, of which speech is Pranava. And then Nyayehi Tribihi Udiranam, whose Yasam Udiranam, the pronunciation of those speech is done by three Nyayas. Nyayehi Tribihi Udatta Anudatta and Swarita. Karma Yajnaha Phalam Swargaha Cha. So this is Yajnaha Karma, who is the right to be performed uh, and uh, the, the Swarga is the Phalam. Yasam Karma Yajnaha. The uh, action that is given in that Veda is Yajnam. And the uh, result of those Vedas, Yasam Phalam, Swargaha. The result of those Vedas are also Swargam. And who is the Prabhava for all of this? You are the source for all of these speeches, which is the Veda. So, Vedaha api tvad udbhutaha eva ityahuhu. So, tvam tasam giram prabhavaha, tasam tadrishinam giram vacham, yachabda vakya visheshana vashat veda vakyanam ityartaha. So, yasam giram. So, yasam, you, you don't know. See, giram is just a speech. It doesn't say Vedas in any way. You only take the clues that are given in the earlier three padas and conclude that it is Veda Vakya. So, yet Shabda Vakya Visheshana Vashat, because of the force of the adjectives which are given by the yet Shabda Yasam Iti Shabdena. So, Veda Vakyanam Iti, we conclude that it is the Veda Vakya. Prabhavaha Udbhavasthanam Asi, you are the uh, source for all of those. Atra Tarkika Stavate. Kaviriva Kavyam Maheshwaraha Veda Vakyani Arachitavan Ityahu Vedantinastu Nishwasarupena Parabrahmanaha Eva Udbu Yamanaha Yesya Nishwasitam Vedaha Iti Uptam. That is what is accepted by Vedantins. Whereas in Parkika, they think that uh, Ishwara has written it like a Kavya. So that's the difference in uh, uh, philosophy, the uh, standpoint of philosophy. So Sarvatha Abhi. Whether it has been written as a Kavyam or whether it is an Ishwasitam, as a breath, the Vedas came out. Either way, you are the cause for the Vedas. That is clear. So, Sarvatha Api, in either way, always, Vedas have come from you. They have you as, your, as their source. Kidrashinam giram ityatra tasam vedatva dyotakam visheshana trayam. So they just, these are indicatory visheshanas, uh, adjectives. Tatra Adho, the way he has separated these three, we may just think that it is just three adjectives, but the way he gives is beautiful. See, Tatra Adho, Adhyayana Arambha Samaye Eva Avagamyam Vishesham. The moment you start your Adhyayana of Vedas, Vedadhyayanam, the first thing is Om. That Omkara Pranava Mantram is the starting point and you realize that, that from there itself you know because Omkaro Atashabdascha Brahmanaha Kantambitva Agato. So Omkara is nothing other than Brahma. If you take off Shabda Brahma, that is represented by Omkara. Omkara is just the uh, form of it, Nama and Nama Namnyoho Abhedaha. The one who has the nomenclature and the Samgnya, there is no difference between the two of them. Okay, so here Tatra Adho Adhyayana Arambha Samaya Eva Avagambhyam, you understand that Yasam Pranavaha Udghataha. So Yasam Giram okay, Pranavaha. Okay. Yeah. What is the context in which you said the Nama Namnayoho Abhedaha? Omkara itself, see how do you know that Omkara itself is Veda? Anything can start with Om. Mm. Right, but Om as a word itself, it represents Brahma. Mm. And so, it because you it, it, it is the beginning of the Vedas, it, it shows that, that Omkara, ha, the Vedas have come from the Omkara. It starts off from the Omkara and Omkara is the source of that also. And hence, Brahma is the, Brahman is the source for the Vedas also. Oh, okay. So, Om is just a representation of Brahman. Oh. That's why I said that. So, Yasam Pranavaha, uh, Yasam Giram, Pranavaha, Pranava Ucharanam Udghataha Arambha. Uh, Yaha Giraha, Pranava Ucharanapurvakam Ucharyante. 
the words or the speech that is always started off with omkara anena aarambha samaye eva girantara vyatirekah uktah in the beginning itself you understand that normal speech you never start with om any normal talking conversation does not start with om so the moment you say that it starts from om you say that this speech is different from any normal speech which is so this speech is vedas next is adhyayana velayam vyatirekam ahuhu so in the beginning of adhyayanam next is during adhyayanam you have difference the vedas are distinguished because of the udatta anudatta swarita right and nobody uses udatta anudatta swaritam in uh, normal speech there are different types of swaras that come out uh, when we talk intonation there are people who talk without any intonation also uh, mine you will have more of intonations here in my speech but then yeah each one has their way of emphasis and in intonations generally tribihi nyayaihi udiranam ityukte tatra vedanam eva tatra suchakam vyotakam so tribihi nyayaihi udatta anudatta swarita bedena tribihi vyavasthabihi udiranam vyavastha is uh, um, conditions these are the three conditions with which you have to recite vedas ar atha the next is artha gnanam now you understand the meaning of it you want to know what these vedas are so first you do you start your adhyayanam then during the adhyayanam you have udatta anudatta swarita the next part karma yagna swarga phalam this comes from the understanding of the vedas so artha gnana samaye api vyatirekam ahu there is a difference no none other no other text or speech veda other than vedas gives you a, an action which is yaga you know about yagam only from vedas and you know about swargam and you receive swarga as a phalam only from vedas so yagna phalam swarga karma iti yagna yaga tasya phalam swarga tat karma cha so in in the sense yagasya phalam tu swarga swarga स्वर्गकामः काम यजेत स्वर्ग से कर्म अत्रैव उच्यते सो एव्रीबडी गोज आफ्टर फलम फर्स्ट यू नेवर स्टार्ट ऑफ विद ओके आई हैव टू डू दिस वर्क यू ऑलवेज थिंक अबाउट व्हाट इज द रिजल्ट दैट आई एम गोइंग टू गेट इफ आई एम गोइंग टू डू दिस वर्क देन यस आई विल गेट दैट रिजल्ट ओके नाउ लेट मी डू दिस वर्क सो ही राइट्स इट इन दैट फॉर्मैट एंड ही सेज याग अत्र विधीयते वेदेश किमर्थ याग से फल तो स्वर्ग खलु तस्मा स्वर्ग से कर्म याग तग प्रतिद्य वेद ओके सो प्रतिद्यम प्रतिदन क्रियायां यज्ञ स्वर्गयो कर्म कर्म इति उक्त यज्ञ स्वर्गयो कर्म यज्ञ एंड स्वर्ग बोथ आर Uh, the karma of the kriya that is being enjoined in the vedas so vedeshu ukta kriyaya karmatvantu tatra yagam swargancha swargam tu avantara phalam iti karanat tatra swargam api karma rupena eva uchyate so yasam giram yagaha cha tat phalabhutaha swargaha cha pratipadya so those speech which talks about yagam which is the karma and swargam which is the result so these are just indicatory visheshanas which tell you that the giram that he mentions here is only vedas right so udghatah pranavah yasam adhyayana kale as soon as you start studying om is the first utterance for this speech nyaye stribihi udiranam it is also said with three fold uh, uh, three different intonations of udatta anudatta and swarita कर्म यज्ञ फल स्वर्ग प्रतिपाद्यम विद्यते फॉर फॉर दैट स्पीच वेर द राइट्स दैट हैव टू बी परफॉर्मड आर एक्सप्लेन एज याग इन इट एंड द फ्रूट दैट हैज टू बी अटेन्ड इज हेवन दिस इज ऑलसो नोन स्वर्ग दिस इज ऑलसो नोन ओनली थ्रू दोज स्पीच तम प्रभव तादृशा गिरा तादृशी गिरा okay so you are the source for those speeches yeah so it's a different uh, way of commentary like very beautifully done like you said in malinata doesn't bring it this way he doesn't take it in different way 
He is yeah, the different, completely unique method of. Uh... His method is uh, very very practical. It is it is like a Vyakhyana standard for people today. Mm-hmm. Uh, nobody thinks beyond the words and uh, tries to explain like Narayana Pandita. Mm-hmm. Definitely a, a, a joy for Sahitya readers. <laughs> Uh, Sahirdaya. Mm. The way he does is simple, no? Uh, where does he say that? Uh, oh, he includes another shloka there. Drava Sanghata Katinaha, Stula Sukshmaha, Laguhu Guruhu, Vyakto, Vyakte Taraha Cha Asi, Prakamyamte Vibhutishu. Uh, maybe I'll do that shloka next time. Putra. Uh, Malinatha, no, in that. Uh, Kale edition, there is ah. another extra shloka. Oh, in the middle, yes, Dravaha Sangata. Yes, correct. Mm. Sangata. Yeah, Sukshma. There is an extra shloka here. I'll do that next time. Maybe yeah. I'll. Okay. His is very simple, Vyakhan. Mm. Okay.